What's going on guys, it's your average consumer. And as you can see, it's time for another massive tech unboxing. This one is number 35. I feel old now. But you guys know the deal. Grab your snacks, grab your drinks, cause yo, check this out. We got a lot of tech to open up today. And Ari, you get to pick the first one. Do I really? No, you don't really? get to pick the first Carl, you get to no, pick No, 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 don't right, play What me. do you want, but what you want? Um, The black one. This one? Yeah. Let's see what you pick, baby. All right, so this is definitely P.O. Box material. Let's see if what you got is a hit or a dud. So it looks like we have a wireless charger oh, for your car. Okay. So, you know, we've never seen this before. Okay, so this is it. It's a circle, you can hold your phone. Man, it's a wireless charger for your car. We know what, we know what this is. Ari, you, you, you failed. Ari, <laughs> myself? Did you wait, 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 we gotta find out what this Mango Madness is okay. about. Oh, okay, wait, hold on. This is a, a scent infuser, I guess, for your car. You got the little oils in here, okay. the scent. Also, is that a dog? Yeah, it is like a dog with sunglasses. Wow. Smells good at least. Your car usually stinks, so you should put it on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't be disrespectful. Don't be disrespectful. My car. What? Um, you know what? For some, Ari just came up with a good idea. So for some of these products that we know we probably won't use, we'll have like a link down below in the description. I don't know, we'll figure out some way to give away some of this stuff to you guys. Yeah. If you're interested. You just claim it, you're welcome in advance. <laughs> All right, Jay, clean up Ari's mess. There's a box that has popcorn. Jay. Jay, it's at the bottom. <laughs> Jay knows I like to snap oh, during I, these videos. I, I get out of here. Yeah. All right, so let me figure this out. Popcorn World, so oh my popcorn God. Popcorn World, they actually hit me up on Twitter. They wanted to send over some popcorn. Ari is super excited. I, yeah, you didn't tell me about this. This is exciting. Hopefully was, they have caramel. It was a surprise. You said you hope they have caramel? Yes. Well, let's see. I think they might have sent oh. quite a few. And I hear other tech YouTubers have gotten the popcorn from them, and they say it's really good. Lots of popcorn. Check this out. They have over 250 different flavors. 250? Yes. Damn. Of popcorn. And black owned. Just saying. Oh, hello. Just saying. Check them out. Link down Get below. Get your orders in. Hello. So what we got? We got barbecue bacon. They do that? All right. Crab legs, though. <laughs> Hold on. I like it. It's 250 flavors. I guess you gotta have some you gotta get, wild ones with crab get legs. A little creative. <laughs> Flaming hot. No, thank you. Jalapeno spinach. Oreo cheesecake. Yo, oh these my are, god. These are out Pass there. Pass that. Oh, she caught it. Oh, don't play me. Should we, I mean, I feel like I gotta try. You gotta, yeah, you have to try. I gotta try one on camera, right? Mm -hmm. I'm do gonna the Snickers. Go, I'm gonna do Snickers. And then Carl's gonna do crab legs. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get Carl to do the crab legs. <laughs> ha, I grabbed my snack. <laughs> <laughs> Does it taste like Snickers? Shut up. That's crazy. It tastes like Snickers? Yes. So this is it. And this, there's like no GMOs in it. It's these Super are like healthy. real, real ingredients. Whoa. Yeah. I'm not mad at this at all. Right, all right, crab legs next. Crab legs, let's go. We'll get to the tech in a second, guys. Hold on. <laughs> we just have to have fun. We don't get to do this often. All right, Carl. We got these crab legs. <laughs> this is amazing. Okay, this is dope. Check them out, links down below in the description. This is mind-blowing stuff. All right, little cousin, you're next. The one on top right here. This one? No. Which one? Describe it. Now. Now. <laughs> he said now. Jesus Christ. All right. An Amazon smart plug? Let me explain. Okay. I was buying stuff on Best Buy, and when I was checking out, they are like, hey, you can save if you bundle it with these items. So I got that smart plug for like five bucks. So I was like, okay, let me just do the, the, the bundle. Oh, really? For like five bucks? Yeah, something like five or ten dollars. Yeah. It's actually pretty good. Yeah. Smart plugs are necessary if you want to have a smart home. So let's pop this open, this nice little extra bundle thing that Ari got here. Oh, it's type big though. Dang. <laughs> It's cool, you know? It needs the Wi-Fi adapters and all that. It's a smart wall adapter. It makes things like regular little lamps like that smart. Alexa can control it or Google, whatever you use. So this is cool. You know what we need to do? What? I need to send you on a mission. You buy a bunch of tech. 
and then surprise me. I like it. I got one that I want to open already. Oh, <laughs> I knew Jay was gonna go crazy. We got that A7S3. Yeah, Jay's like, what? I had to surprise you, my man. So we got the newest Sony A7S3, a camera that we've been waiting years for. This bad boy should just change the game for us. Let's just take a quick look at the body. I know we don't have too many probably camera lovers out there, so we won't spend too long. Oh, it's bigger. And the big thing here is the pop-out screen. Finally, it's here, Ari. Wow. You know, Ari's happy Ari. for you. <laughs> <laughs> but we will put this bad boy to work. Moving on, every video that you see on this channel will probably be shot with this guy. Well shot on this. Yeah, he said. <laughs> no probably. He said, well. <laughs> Jason Nick, no probably. It will be. But this thing is nuts. No recording times, no overheating. Wait, so you won't have to stop anyone but like, oh, the camera's overheated. Yeah, it. and there's no record time. Oh. So like we won't have to stop every 30, 29 minutes yeah. and 59 seconds. Yeah. These guys would sit there with like a fan <laughs> blowing the camera. Listen, you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> All right, UPS store. No way. Aki made a mouse pad with RGB lights on it. This box looks just like a Corsair box, I will say. Oh, it does, the black and yellow. <laughs> it looks just like a Corsair box. Aki, switch it up, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> They're probably hoping people think Corsair. <laughs> oh, look, there goes that Corsair. <laughs> Let me just grab that real quick. I like their stuff. This mat feels actually pretty solid, feels nice. Is there a battery built into this? All right, so it turns out it's not wireless. You can't just, uh, you know, unplug this thing and, you know, have it keep running. But that's okay. At least you have the option of removing the cable. Uh, usually with mouse pads like this, that cable is attached. There's no taking it off. So if you ever feel like you just want to have a clean desk area with no cables, you can have an option like this. Okay, so this is uh, something from JBL. Listen, I hate things that are packaged with these guys because they get everywhere and they're really hard to clean up. So this right here is the Club 950NC by JBL and Intel. So these are some noise canceling headphones. Pretty nice, small case. Okay, I kind of like the feel of these. And these are, oh, little plates. I guess you can customize what you put on the sides. Oh, these are some interesting ear cups too. This feels really, really premium. Feels pretty comfortable. I like how solid it feels. The materials they use definitely feel nice. These are definitely Bluetooth headphones. And we've also got their audio cable. Oh man, it uses a 2.5 millimeter cable to plug in. I'm gonna test these out, let you guys know what I think about them because they feel really good in the hand. These feel premium. Stay tuned. I think I might drop something on this. All right, next up, I'm gonna go for this big guy over here. So clearly, you guys, as you can see, we've got a laptop in here. Dang, this is some, look at this, pa yo, this is some crazy packaging. But all right, ladies and gentlemen, what we've got over here is the Asus ROG Zephyrus G14 acronym. Asus actually teamed up with a design agency called Acronym to create this version of the Zephyrus G14. And it's got an interesting looking design, check it out. So as you can see, it's got multiple colors. It's a very, very unique looking laptop. All right, check this out. Oh, oh wow. So as you can see, the design of this laptop is very different, but something else that's also different is the back of the screen. Now, it looks like it's just like a perforated uh, back, but it's not just a simple back. Check this out. Do a little something here, a little something there. And you guys see that? You see the lights? Yeah. It's like magic, baby. But no, Asus does have uh, a special tool that you can go into and you can customize what's going on in the back here. You can make all kinds of cool animations. I like the ability to like kind of customize what your laptop looks like. I think that's really cool. But for those spec heads out there who are curious about the specs, we're gonna throw them up on the screen so you guys can see it. This thing is a gaming laptop, so of course you'll be able to game that RTX 2060 in here. It's no joke, and it's a 14 inch laptop, so this thing is nice and portable. If you guys are interested in learning more, I'll have links down below in the description. You guys could check it out. Thanks to Asus for sending this out. All right, next. I mean, this looks like a phone. Oh, this isn't a phone. So what we have here, it holds the key to unlocking 
the super saf style. Saf sent this over. I got the shades, y'all. <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Oh, hello. Okay. Do I look super? Yes. Do I, do I look saffy? Yeah. Yeah. You super need an accent, though. Do I look super? <laughs> <laughs> I, Never mind. The, Saf is actually selling these now, but I think they're sold out. They flew off the shelves. I don't know if you can get your hands on them anymore, but if he restocks, I'll have him linked down below in the description. But these are dope and super, super reflective. I like how they say super Saf style on the sides too. That's, that's kind of that's kind of dope. All right, Saf, thank you for hooking me up with the swag, my man. I need like a something to lean on. Too but, bad you don't have thicker eyebrows, you know. So and you know. a better beard. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, now, ooh, this is heavy. We got a little something from our folks over at Nomad. So first things first, we got the new Nomad Base Station Pro. So with this Base Station Pro, you're pretty much gonna get the closest thing to, what was it, Air, Air Power? See, it's been so long, I don't even remember the name. So you guys might've seen the base station that we have with the Apple Watch. It's a much smaller version than this. So with this guy, you'll be able to charge like three different devices. Check this guy out, it's the cutest thing ever. But this thing is solid feeling, man. And we of course have a nice thick USB type C cable and the power brick to go with it. And we also have a little something else. What's in here? Oh, adapters for other countries. Now they also sent over some other stuff. Okay, so a USB type C cable. Oh, this cable is, this is a heavy duty cable. And it's made with Kevlar. Now, if you're not familiar with Kevlar, it's really, really strong material. And we also have some iPad Pro cases over here. So you can use the Apple Pencil with it and everything. Oh man, this feels nice. This leather. All right, Ari, you want to pick the next one? Yes. It's been a while. I know. Let's get you involved. Which one? The envelope. Is it from the P.O. Box? P.O. Box. Okay, no, never mind. Oh, Ari, <laughs> Ari's learned her lesson. We'll do this one right there. Which one? This one? Yes. All right, so let's see. So what we have over here, an Xbox controller. Wonder Woman. Oh, so, oh I think I saw something about this where... They had like these Wonder Woman controllers. It's been a while since we've Can seen see? an Xbox controller. Now I think they uh -huh. got this one custom done. It doesn't have a box or anything, but still very cool. Well, you don't like Wonder Woman? No, no, it looks nice, looks great. She doesn't care at all. <laughs> all right, so what is this guy? Oh, ho, oh, I forgot I ordered this. So you guys might know this. I am a huge Apex Legends fan and I saw one of the Apex Legends uh, content creators on YouTube post a link to this Etsy page that has one of the, I guess, sort of weapons from the game. This is the Wraith Heirloom. And dang, this thing looks, it looks good. Last time we opened like actual kunais that can kill somebody, not quite this one. This one's safe, we don't have to worry, Carl. <laughs> For all my Apex Legends fans, you know, this is Wraith's heirloom. She'd be running around. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's exactly what it looks <laughs> That's like. That's exactly what it looks like. But this is dope. And I think it came with a stand. Boom. I love it. Whoops. Arbo Leaf Body Composition Scale. Okay, okay. So this looks like it's a smart scale that works with Android, iOS. All right, boom. So here we have it. We've got a smart scale. I'll throw up a Judd says if with the price so that you guys can see, but usually smart scales, they're not that expensive anymore. They're actually pretty inexpensive. Boom. This is one from Arbo Leaf in black. Dang, y'all, we got a lot of packages still. <laughs> I know. Okay, this is also from Aki. This is a gaming mouse. Pretty standard looking mouse. Uh, I'm sure it has like RGB lights over here and I think also on the wheel. Plug it into our Zephyrus over here. Yep. Just as I expected. All right, Jay, you next. Of course. Of course. Oh, ho, ho, nice. We've got some stuff from Nanoleaf. So this is one of their newer products. These are the Nanoleaf hexagons. Now, some of you might know Nanoleaf. We've got some Nanoleafs up there running across the wall. Those are the squares. New features, Jay. They got this pretty much the same stuff, but just like a new design. Now, I've been very weary about throwing too many RGBs into this setup. But what do you guys think? You think I should add more? What do you think, Ari? You like RGB, but you do have a specific vibe that you want for this place. Keep it cool down here. 
Okay. Keep it chill. <laughs> this is the kind of place where you can sit back with a scotch. Okay. <laughs> and sure. vibe out, you know. And, and check out some Gundams. There, right, there right, yeah. <laughs> Very grown man-ish. <laughs> Oh, I know what this is. This is from another YouTuber, Random Frank P. He came out with his own mouse pad design and it actually looks really dope. I like this a lot. I could tell you guys go check it out and support and all that, but this stuff sells out too every time he posts it. So if you're lucky, you might get your hands on it. But even for me, it took a long time. I'll of course have his stuff linked down. Oh my down God, below. that's huge. Yeah, you know, they make really big mouse pads. This is one of them. Didn't I do this before? Remember this, Jay? Yes, this is a throwback. So we've seen this before. I guess now they've added some quick charge ports and it uses a pretty, pretty large power brick. And you've got a USB cable in here so you can connect it to your computer. All right, this one is from Best Buy. I think this is also something you picked up, huh, Ari? Oh yeah. The Echo Glow. So this is a multicolor smart lamp for your Echo. I'm not gonna lie, it's kind of hard to keep up with all the Echo products that come out these days. And there are new ones. There, like, there's a bunch of new coming. ones. Yeah. So it's just like a nightlight. And I saw Echo and I saw a light and I said, okay, great. Job would like this. I mean, a smart light. It, it it belongs on a tech channel, right? Maybe we can put it in a uh, Austin's room or something. Oh, that would be so cute. Right. Yeah. Aki. Sent over a keyboard. Let's take a look at it really quickly. I actually like the feel of this keyboard. I like it a lot. It's an envelope. So this guy right here will wipe a computer completely clean, like wipe a hard drive completely. So I, I don't know, if you've got some top secret stuff and I don't know, you're about to get raided or something, I don't know, why else would you use this? This is scary. <laughs> That's why the red. Ooh, oh man, I wish we got this earlier. We got another Xbox controller. Yo, these boxes are piling up. That's a lot of recycling to do. All right, so we have the Arctic Camo Edition. Because it's been so long since we featured an Xbox controller, it's only right that we feature two of them. Oh, and it comes with a little fanny pack, you oh, know? If you got a game on the go, like you don't know when you're gonna encounter an Xbox on the, what? Yo, is that an Xbox? Nah, hold up. It's ridiculous. Hmm, look, look at my. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not. There we go. Yo, is that an Xbox? <laughs> oh, this is dope though. This is a really nice controller. You know, this is swaggy over here. And we got some socks. Ooh, okay. Arctic Camel Special Edition, why not? If you're gonna make a fanny pack, you might as well make some socks, right? Yeah. I can't wait till we start getting Xbox Series X controllers. Yeah, November, baby. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so this is one of those things I randomly bought off of uh, Amazon. So this is a portable fan and it has lights, you guys. Ah. You see what my, my team gets excited for? <laughs> All right, so you put this on your neck and you're just, you're chilling. Babe. You do not look cool <laughs> at all. I'm, listen, I'm living in 3020 right now. <laughs> like I'm walking around with a cooling system. Wow. Yeah, you like it, right, Jay? Yeah. You, you heard the guys. Ooh. <laughs> don't wear this in public, you said? Yeah, not with me. I don't care. Solo dolo, I go out by myself. <laughs> I turn off now. A UV smart portable sanitizer box. Oh, I love that. We can put booths like pacifiers in there. Really? Yeah. You trust the UV cleaning that much? We can clean it and then put it in there for extra cleaning. Let's see, this is a box where you can throw things into. And what it does is you plug it in and it uses UV lights to sanitize. Now, how much does it actually work? I don't know. Uh, but if you believe, maybe it works. Ari believes apparently. Yeah, I do. <laughs> <laughs> we got some cases. All right, well, click that link down below and claim your case. And I even have a tempered glass screen protector for that big old camera hump on the Note 20 Ultra. Makes sense. Now, this is the last one from the P.O. Box. You think it's going to be a bust? Or Definitely. you think it's going to be great? No, I think it's going to be a bust. Carl? I think great. Jay? Should be good, okay. Oh, I'm the only one sitting here being I... negative. <laughs> no, 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 I'm with you, babe. Okay. I think this will be horrible. And here we have it, you guys. What? <laughs> Another UV <laughs> smartphone portable sanitizer box. No. 
a destroyed box at that. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody could get this if they wanted. it. That about wraps it up for this massive tech unboxing. This one was number 35. How do we feel about this one, guys? We got the camera. Yeah. Jay and would... that popcorn, hello. Okay, hold on. Camera, popcorn, these headphones, that Arctic camo controller, yeah. super soft glasses. That Nomad thing? Not too bad. Everything will be linked down below. Shout out to all the companies who sent something over. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, be the cool guy or girl that gives this video a thumbs up. And thanks for watching. We'll catch you guys in the next one. Till then, it's your average consumer. Peace. <laughs> Peace. Why do you got to ruin my fun?